And here's the second part of the space limo. Oh, uh, again, a uh, semi truck. This uh, well, coupler attachment right here, and trailer uh, assembly. Uh, let's see, I used uh, Creo pieces and Lego and a bit of a Mega Con blocks, which is right up in here, and uh, that uh, that uh, piece right there. Uh, oh yeah, and some Tinkai Knight stuff here, which is uh, these ball joints right on the sides of these doors. Now, uh, as you can tell, here's uh, uh, the roof of it, which is, uh, it's not glass panels, but anyway, how, uh, use some snot building for, uh, these on the side, and, uh, let's see, all this up here is snot, stuff's not on top, snot, it's delicious, you have to try it. And let's see, these are, uh, Creo, uh, projectile launchers. And let's see, disengage the locks. There's a bottom lock and a, well, top lock that you disengage to open the doors. Open the cargo bay doors! Oh yeah, and you can see that there's, a uh, eight, uh, landing pad feet. And, yes, there's enough room for them to be sitting down. I haven't really tried a minifig in there yet. But yeah, here's... Uh, some Creons in there. Some custom ones. Now... To uh, show you the full interior of it... I have to... Well... Take off all these warning parts. Yeah, because, you know, I don't know who's going to be standing on top of that when it's floating in space. A space alien, you know, maybe Emperor Zerg, because he came from the planet Duplo. <laughs> I don't know. Now, uh, as you can see, all the way in the back right there, there's the uh, 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 main control of uh, system. And yes, uh, the pilot of it is uh, laying down like a. Um, Deck like a pool chair, those things that you lay down in. It's kind of like a bed, kind of. And let's see, these are little cabinets that can't open. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, my bad. I think there's something in here, but I'm not sure. And let's see, there's mixel bowl joints here, here, and here. Yep, here. You know, all open. You know, these three pieces are attached by mixel bowl joints. Well, yeah. And, yeah, that's the, uh, uh, tool panel, I guess. I don't know, I was using whatever I had on hand. And, let's see, there's, right here's the, uh, fuse box. Too close to the doors. And, yeah, the doors can just close up like that. Let's see. Now, speaking of, gotta get this, all this back on. And those are, uh, Creo, uh, uh, panel pieces, uh, let's see, that's, they're, uh, four by, hmm, can't really measure it, I think they're like, four by ten? Yeah, possibly. But they, uh, work good. Now, getting the locks on is a bit tricky. I like to start with the top one first. Well, not the locks, but the doors. I like to start with the top lock first. Uh, hold on. Let me just... Well, get it off screen a, a bit. Now... Uh, it's a bit finicky. Uh, 
Again, I really didn't design this for play use. I designed it for, you know, display use. Yeah, display, not play. Now, once I've got them like that, I can just attach the bottom lock and that's it. Now, putting these back on, which is simple as that. I like to put these uh, warning ones right up here. Again, they got stickers on them. And my view of stickers are love them, hate them, we have them. You don't get them on right, you don't get them on right. If they're clear backed, they're fine. If they're paper backed, uh, might as well not use them. And here it is. Oh, hold on. Now here it is. The uh, main unit altogether.